Hey folks, welcome back to Manor Lords. I have a feeling this is going to be a rather bright, snowy episode because it's only just turned December, so we're going to be here a while. And we're going to be actually right here for a while. But before we do, I need to make a couple of changes, then I will explain myself after. Where's our joiner? There you are. I need to make sure that you are making wooden parts and Gimli as well. Let's see, Gimli, you're over here. Wooden parts. Uh, no, joiner. Joiner right there. So you were making, you were making shields. Oh, okay. Well, tell you what, let's switch back to wooden parts for now. We could use it. And I think we're fine over in Gandalf. The reason I did that is I've received a comment explaining to me a little bit more about how the trader works in this newest update. When we left the original um, patch, original, what was it? 7.95, I think it was. We used to have something that told us that for the major trades, they were not available until you bought the trade route. And you had to buy the trade route to make it work. This was grayed out. You couldn't choose to export anything. And so when 972 hit, all that went away. You know, right now it's red only because we can't afford it. We've only got 31. But they were available. So I interpreted that as, okay, we've changed the idea that you, you can't trade at all unless you pay for it. Because that was always strange to me that you had to pay for it. Because you can put in your own traders. And you can get your own horses. And they set up a cart carrying a rider. So, they, you know, you, you get your own trader. So why can't he, and he will, go all the way off the map and trade whatever? So it just doesn't make sense to see, can I... No, I can't. Can I choose you? Is there a shortcut to get back, trader? No, I, gotta, I just gotta go find my way back. But it didn't make sense that they can't just, you know, do their own trades. That we are dependent upon having to buy another route when our guys could do the same job. So I interpreted it as, you pay for this and somebody else will be dedicated to coming in and getting your roofing tiles or if you got you know if you're patient then we can set up our own trading system and we can send out the export the roofing tiles turns out that's not it it allows us to do it now because of this system here now we are able to send to our own people in another province without having to pay the the tariff so it is a route that is available in this condition. Unfortunately, I, I wish this was done differently. I wish that I could, while this is checked, meaning to not, you know, to, to sell other people, to sell to, how's it worded, foreigners? By turning this setting off, you tell your workers to only trade between the regions on the map and ignore trade points and free merchants. So in other words, this will go to, this will go to foreigners if it's checked. That should then turn this off. And then when you uncheck it to go to your own peoples, then, I don't know, it, 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 it wasn't intuitive to me. And so that's why we've not been able to sell anything but, turns out, wooden parts. Because wooden parts are right over here, and they are a minor trade, and they will head out. There's no NA for the, the, uh, the, the value. Whereas everything over here in, in military is a major trade. And so we don't know the value until we buy the trade route. Another gripe of mine. How do I know that I want to start specializing in sidearms if I don't know what sidearms are worth? i got to pay 72 just to find out what they're worth. That doesn't make sense to me. You are what? We're disconnected. Where are we disconnected? i got all kinds of connections in there. What do you mean we're disconnected? We're not disconnected. You don't know what you're talking about. Um, so, in order to get ourselves up to 80? Let's see. Roofing tiles. Let's start there. Uh, we, we could go the other route, too. Let's see which is the cheapest. And Forcer's Huts. I want to go play at the Forcer's Huts. Uh, trade. And we've got roofing tiles one more time. And regular large shields. Okay. So, trade. You guys. So, you want 50. Oh, we can do it at 50. 
and we can do it at 56. Now, have we taken this perk? We did not. This will cut our cost in half, which now makes this worthwhile to take as one of our six points in every one of our provinces if we absolutely have to buy routes in order to bring in a decent income. So that one suddenly became a lot more valuable. I was starting to ignore them because I assumed that we could do our own. But apparently that's not the thing anymore. So that case, and you're just going to spam me and spam me. Okay, let's just do it. You're right there. The road is right there. And in between episodes, I went from there to there. And I went from there to there. And it was in place. Well, now it's in place four times. Now we have four connections. Okay. So in that case, I want to save some funds in Samwise by turning off our taxes. So we're no longer... We could, though, up our... Inf now our influence is probably fine. Okay, so we're no longer going to be paying you taxes over here until we've got a route coming in that could definitely help us. So 50 and 56 for the costs of the two shield routes, 50, 56, and the roofing tiles are 80. So I guess we're going with the, oh, the small shields first when this gets up there, which could happen soon. We had five, now we have one. So somebody has picked up some trading, trading. So one of the two traders have, and you're stocking up, but you are off the map. That's interesting. I wonder what that means. I'm not buying anything, right? I don't remember there being any imports. Uh, exports. Nothing over here. Nothing over here. And plus 10. Something just happened. Or somebody else has just bought something from us. And one of the other traders. Anybody? Who are you? No, you're, you're our own people. Okay. Well, we're at 46 now. So... Little by little, we're going to get over that 50 and get this guy operating. Then we'll test it again and see if it truly does start selling the uh, the small shields. Foresters. We've got a couple of those that have popped in. Let's get a family. Um, how are we doing over here? Any, any, no, nope, no grains are left. So two are available. Great. So family over here in the Forester's Hut. And long term, Emmer. Flax, flax is over here, and barley is kind of over here too. So we're probably going to take this forest down. In fact, let's just tell you guys to do that. Advanced, and you're working kind of over here next, but I want to flax one more time. Barley, flax. So over here and over there. One more time. You, nope, it takes it away. Darn. So advanced and a little bit bigger uh, right in about like that so you guys work on that area and we'll add more fields over there um, so that to figure out where we do or do not want these guys to be working so I want you guys to be making trees and filling it in heavy hmm we'll go for there I want to see this one more time was there anything left over here uh, flax is not over here, just, well, the, the two, but not the, th the three or the highest level. Barley's over here. Okay, so this whole area up to there. One more time. You, advanced, you. So from there, and there, and a little bit bigger. Something like that. You guys fill this in real heavy, and these guys can just keep chopping it all back down. And Gimli, I want to do that real quick over here, too. And I want to make sure that you, I did already, right? You're making wooden parts. Uh, joiner shop and general wooden parts game. Okay. So Forrester went in. You were back in this area, right? Forrester set two. Where do we want to force? It was over here. That's right. So the woodcutters making firewood. I gave them this whole area just to get us some serious firewood. And let's just start to replant that whole area too. Um, all the way out like so. I think so. Just have a ball. And we need a family in there, don't we? You, yeah, there we go. So one family in there, and you just do your thing. You are already down on animals again. I only just put this family in. That is so strange how this one just falls apart. Within almost no time at all. Less than a month. Hunter? No, you're, yeah, you're pulling in a carcass. 
You are just shot a carcass. Shot a, an animal to make a carcass. Here? It must be there under the snow somewhere. I see an antler. All right, so... Wow, we flew, flew out of there. You are Gandalf. Let's come back to you. So over here, we are 46, still in December. When we roll over to January, we'll pull in... Six tier two coins. So six coins will come in. Make that a 52. Tier ones don't bring in any coins. But, and tier threes bring in two coins a month, but we don't have any of those. Okay. And as long as we are still making... Can I kick that up any? Boy, to do that, I'd have to move it over to a plot that has um, two houses. So probably not. What does it cost to make a wooden, plan, uh, wooden part? You are two planks versus one plank. So this is definitely the better income source. Once we get this going again. Okay. Planks over here are 68. We're fine. Okay. Gandalf storage is full in the saw pit. Does that mean... That means the general, not the logs. Okay. Pull you out of that one. There is the beauty of having two saw pits. And just put you right back into that one. Storage is empty. Okay. We'll go that route. Um, again, with Samwise. So... You... Or over here we have three parts ready to sell so that's bringing in little bits of income and the it was bringing in five each so that's actually really good i believe that the small shields are supposed to be five each but you would never know it until you bought the route which again doesn't make any sense to me but we eventually want to get back over to selling uh, roof tiles because that's that's the industry we want to focus on over here we've got this this uh, rich deposit of clay, and we'll be chipping away at that forever. So, anyway, over in here, how are we for housing? We're doing pretty good on our our approval rating. Housing, do we have anything that isn't already moved in? We do not. So, where do we want to move to and get a few more uh, houses in place and, and building? We were going to be doing this with our next 50 that comes in after we get our trade route going but these houses are built and tab we have space for three right in here so we aren't too far behind there we do have a space here for a road um and another plot though it's a really long plot can we put some plots in this direction um tab and what was that last one the windmill's in oh we moved the windmill in gandalf that's right. But we don't need it till next September. Okay, we are building one mill in Gimli, though. So you need to go check on that. Um, I want you and Emmer is great over here. Really is. And I think that was going to be more fields. I think so. Because we're going to be... We, we're doing Emmer for this farm over here. Maybe another farm building later. But this would be great to get some ammo over here. Flax, that's not a thing over here. Barley is kind of a thing over here. Now, Emmer over here, it is the whole area. It is. And this could be just some closer housing for the farms that are going to be right in here between Emmer and Barley. Okay. So, road, how best? In between? I think in between. That way we can end them wherever we want to. And you can go back to being goats and, and uh, chickens. So let's grab houses. And do we double up on them or not? So road. Road first. You're going like so. And you just send you off in that direction somewhere. And that one drives me nuts a little, but it'll be fine. <laughs> Housing. So we'll grab that corner and we'll head... We have plenty of logs, I'm pretty sure. Let's take us out to here. Head about that far in. Now we are... We don't have a bunch of logs. Really? Oh, we have eight. Okay. Well, we can take you down to four. So we don't get any backyards here. So pull off, go a little further. There's some backyards. That gives us what we need. As far as... I'm seeing my road right there. Okay, I can still grab off of that. We are, or January? Wow, I thought we were 
not that far into December yet. Anyway, you click there, and minus, minus. That gives us, we must have hit 10. Nice wider lots that look better in a double right there. Let's do it. You guys go in, and these two families have something to build, and a third family here in a few moments will have even more to build. Okay, so let's see here. Turn off snap to road. 25 just came in. Great, let's get this going. You are... You must have sold off more of those. Trade and shields. Little shields first. 50. Grab you. And establish a trade route. Yeah. And now it tells us... So, we should know that before we invest into it to know that that's what we want to do that's just backwards anyway now we can be selling these and we are going to be selling them outside of our foreign trade so that would be the right setting there and peoples you are well, you're stocking up you are guiding an ox for some reason you are is anybody trading nobody is actually oh there's one trading right there Thomas is trading, and he's just going to hoof it. Hmm. Going home, waitings. So, we'll wait and see how this works. Now, Halfwit Brett had mentioned to me that he's discovered that the trading posts, two of them in the same province, tend to work in tandem. Meaning, over here, we have now roof tiles. Let's go to... There it is, five. So it isn't orders per trading post, it's orders or routes bought per province. So I think the advantage here if we have lots of population is you'd be able to then stock two more horses in this one. And you know, we could do something like that. Let's do that and that. And since the orders transfer over automatically, let's... Boy, I'd love to have a... Do I have a... I do have a livestock trader. I do. And we can buy one horse, I think. No, we haven't taken the perk. What's it take to get this perk? Ooh, it takes a lot. Yeah, we need one more level two and three level threes. Okay, then we will buy one horse. Yeah, it's going to come in at 30. So it's cheaper with the Livestock Trader if you've taken this perk and you've cut your tariffs down. Over here, show me a trading stall. Right here, trading post. To buy you, yeah, you're 30. So you're the same price as the Livestock Trader until you've taken this. And then it is cheaper at the Livestock Trader. Okay, I just had to take a phone call, so now I'm... Trying to remember where I was. My mom lives way up in the woods and we had a storm today and the power's out and yeah. She's calling into somebody who lives in civilization to figure out, uh, you know, look on the internet for and see what's going on. Anyway, I think I was in the middle of saying, so let's buy a horse. But we need 30 and we have 28. So that's not going to happen just yet. But we can put two horses over here, two horses over here. Kind of like the idea of putting two plows over here and two plows over here. I really kind of like that because I was complaining. Yeah, I, I, I do, do a lot of complaining these days, I know. I'm, I'm expecting more than the game has had time to grow up, to, to catch up to my expectations, apparently. But we've got four families over here, and at one point, another one's working now, but at one point they were all, yeah, because we're not restocking. They were all uh, trading, but only two of them had a horse. So if we were to pop in another one, let's do it. Then we can put two horses in each one. So coins and trading post. And we'll just mirror you. And this will just be wonderful. Is that what I want? I don't know. We have all of these stalls over here. Is there a way to, to make this complex? Make it look more mm, complexive? Complicated. Yeah, some word like that. Let me think. It feels like it's going the opposite direction. I'm trying to spin it. Um, I don't like the look of that. If I got rid of these roads and did something... I don't think there's any room. I think I'm touching roads no matter what I do in there. But that's kind of interesting. That is. Which one of these roads... Boy, if I delete this and it goes all the way through, I'll just pull my hair out. Hmm. Well, this would look like more of a... Of a... Uh, trading complex 
if I could somehow do something like that with a road in between them. Or if we did this, I don't think, I'm too close to the two roads and that corner into that. There's just no way to squeeze this into here by taking those roads out and redoing the area. I've noticed that this is quite pixelated now since this seven, uh, 975 that quite often I'll look and the snow and, and the ground will be really pixelated in just a certain area. Like there's been some optimization done right there. You can see it right where my, my mouse pointer is. Uh, optimization's done for areas that aren't as important or something to try to uh, to assist the... Uh, uh, the frame rate or something so if you are over here you're close enough to where you kind of look like you go there over here it gives us more of a mirror image and symmetry now what I don't know about this and I'll just rattle on while I'm while I'm thinking will the traders hit both places the outside ones the free traders or will they go to the first one that they find and if they don't find the goods they came to buy they turn around and leave and there was a noise while I was thinking about things. So I'm going to just drop you in just like that. Nothing fancy. You just, and we'll, maybe we'll add a road out there. What was the noise? Uh, pause and bandit camp was sighted. Okay. So let's go and deal with that. You were in the woods. Uh, that corner over there. Gotcha. Okay. So, and any information when I pass over you? Uh, I can write to you. It's a pleasure to meet you. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah. Send. Okay, that was that was exciting. All right, you guys, let's head over here, and we're in this area, and there's not much advantage no matter what I do. So let's just drop you in, like so. Four in the back. Swing you around. Let's go a little further. Right over there, like that. Take you to there and let you just walk your way in. Unpause. There we go. Now, what else has happened? You are work area is empty. We are in Gandalf. Work area is here. Okay, so one more time. Yep, that is the work area. So where do we want you guys taking out trees? We've been replanting around here. Show me Emma again. Emmer is right there. It's all pretty wimpy in this area. Probably no gain to try to put other fields in. And I'm pretty sure that they won't drop trees into a field. So let's plant this area up pretty good. Didn't we? We did. So we don't have any grains here. We don't. Okay. So you don't need to be manned. Let's put... Let's take out... Hmm... Yeah, too many thoughts going on in my mind right now. Let's take one of you out and make sure that your area is set for over here and just fill this whole area back in, including the field area. I'm, I'm guessing you're going to skip this so we can get some trees all around the area for that. Although, that's right, I did not want to, to work around the windmill. That's right, I was intentionally doing that. In fact, is that, are you the ones? No, I'd set you guys to do that. So your work area should be still fine. Okay. So in that case, let's... Actually, I was working with you. Let's advance and change our mind on that one. So you've been filling in like so. Let's have you fill in a little bit deeper like that. Okay. And let's tell you guys to go take down trees in that same area. Advanced and you... You're a much smaller footprint, aren't you? Okay. So we do this and... Although, if we ever have to get you guys going again, this is your area. Do I take you across the way? I could. We can take this whole area down and replant it someday. Yeah, let's do that. Let's, let's do something along those lines. You guys work over there. And this forester over here that we had just put in, I think last episode... Two of them? I put two of them in. That's right. I wanted to really kind of diversify where you guys are working. Uh, one in each, sure. Okay, so you guys are going to plant up this whole area minus out over here where we might plant, or we're gonna we're gonna put more housing in. Okay, so you guys can just kind of fill in the, the voids over here, and you guys what over here? 
I think so. So you advance, let's put you, zoom out, and let's fill in around over here. And we'll just get a bunch of trees planted here and there. Now, it feels like the music just changed. I just realized I've got my music turned way down. So, did it change? No. Oh, it did. We've already won. Really? How many are left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So sixteen. Ten of they left they quit at ten because we have so many that are advanced armored. So we intimidated them. Their morale dropped. Interesting. I need to try to remember to get back out here next time while this happens. I'm really curious to see what the uh, what the numbers are. Are Com uh, combat um what was that that category called where we are way out you know we way outclass them i bet you that number is quite high now where is that camp there you are so you are selected yeah you guys drop in like so where are you wow like that and make sure that you are dropping right into the square all right you guys do that i should get a message here in a little bit and that was Gandalf. I was working over there. I feel like I need to get into Gimli here real soon. We are running. We're not. Let's get you running again. So we forced our huts. We moved those around, manned them. We're kind of done. We did that over here. Trading. We are waiting for 30. That's where we're at. Okay. So we have the route bot. We are hopefully... Let's look at this one more time. We had stuck a bunch of... We had 50 in there. I want to say it was 50 and 40 something. Or 60? Maybe we'll have been 60 in there. So people, now that we have something to do, you're trading in your off map. You're trading in your off map. And there's only two of them. You are trading. Fitz, Fritz, you are walking. And I have no way of knowing exactly what you're doing. Unlike the pack stations where I can pass over them and they'll say they're they're moving shields for berries. You know, give me a clue. That last noise was uh, no storage, saw pit, and burgage plot in Samwise is done. Oh, yeah, we did set these guys. Great. So we have room to be moved into. So I wanted to know if you guys, by chance, are grabbing goods from over here. I guess there's 10 new ones over there now. So now we can go back to small shields. You joiner and small shields. That's the best bang for a buck. And do we still have the sense that it's, it should be, we just started it. So it should still be five each. Okay, so that's going again and eventually we're gonna see the benefits of that happening. All right, Gimli, let's work on you. We had asked you guys to put in a mine over here and it happened. We've got one extra family at the moment. So let's kind of just figure out what we are or are not doing. We have plenty of timber, plenty of planks. We are making wooden parts, joiner, wooden parts so that we can be selling them over here. And these two families could actually be doing something about it. You're off map and you're trading and on map and on your way to somewhere. Okay. Um, only wooden parts. And shields. Okay. So shields can stay there until we can afford that route too. Otherwise, let's just kind of figure things out. We're going to want another trading post. I think doubling up on that is probably a, a wise plan now. Something for you guys to sell long term. No, 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 no. We need new message. Okay, we'll pause and wait for that one. We need roofing tiles. So we got this up and running so we can grab our own clay rather than try to pay for it. But we need to turn on the ability to make our own roofing tiles. And where would that be? Show me Emmer out in this area. Right there. We're fine on this side for the most part. Okay. Um, and what are you? You're just no snow. Okay. So over here would allow us to make roofing tiles relatively close. Though up in here seems like a in an industrial kind of area that's kind of forming. Let's go that route. You're over here, and industry is right there. Clay furnace. Back in here, we've got the 
woodcutter, we've got the tanner, we've got the forester, we've got a hunter. Die shop could probably go up in this area somewhere. And that is the wrong button, so let's set you again. Where to? Let's do, and it kind of comes off right in between these two buildings here. So if I set you, I think at an angle, I kind of like that. You're going to go there, and you go green right there. We're uprooting one so we can do that. And let's connect you both here and back in there. And maybe we can kind of route through and get a loop going for easier uh, movement. All right, so you... <clears throat> let's verify something. Oh, I can't anymore. Gimli is the closest town. Let's just verify that that really is how this works. That's how it worked the last time, but I think that was an update ago. So this belongs to the nearest town. I'm thinking it's going to go to Gandalf because it's Gandalf's retinue. Um, otherwise, I wish I had noticed. I guess I can when I'm editing, I'll uh, I'll go back and look at the uh, at the number and see what was in Gimli. But send to the nearest town six. So okay, there's our answer. It did not go to the nearest town. The nearest town from there is in fact Gimli. It's a long way to get down to here. So nearest town is not real. It's not true. It's the town of the retinue. The town of the army that, that took the spoils. So unfortunately that's just how it works. So this is our, our, our field. This is our field. Alright. So you over here and we'll just from now on just keep adding that to the main treasury over here. And we still get to get to where I can see that better right over there four back and yeah something like that okay so we still at year five do not have a king's annual royal tax attributed to us I'm surprised it said did it say here it did not so I guess now can I get to that from I don't know of any other way to get to oh right there help there it is how do you get into that kind of a thing? Upgrades, military, resources, buildings, economy. Economy. Do we have king or royal or annual? Um, treasury. No. Region. Ruler. Single ruler. Click. Nothing happens. Regional wealth. Okay. Nothing is talking, talking about... The king's tax or the annual royal tax or treasury. No, I think we... Diplomacy, retinue, taxes. Taxes doesn't happen. Okay, so not much we can do there. Uh, pull. There we go, close. So, I'm pretty sure in the update notes there was something about... From five year five on, it's one coin per... Person, I think. I think it was person, not household. So per person becomes the tax, which means we're probably in the three to three fifty range by now. Uh, is there a way to see? Well, seventy four, and so two hundred and seventy, two seventy roughly, and over here another, so three seventy four something. So we're gonna need four something when that tax hits. Okay, um, over here. 278 I did see that correctly okay so let's get well I guess we're gonna pay 30 no matter what so let's just have you guys do it so I can do it both at the same time trade let's bring in two more horses import and make bring you up to four oxen I don't know how many we can house um, 11 I think the farms now house them and farms. Did I ever undo that? Oxen, livestock, I didn't. Okay, pull you guys out so that everybody else can be using them now. So if I'm going to be doing this and you have no grain and you or you know, wheat and you have no wheat. So you're out and advance pull you guys out. So let's while I'm thinking about it, let's go ahead and get some more um am I not running? I'm not running. Get some more um Oh, okay. Oh, interesting. Yeah, we got the double again. So we're, That's still not been fixed. You get double when you bring it to your town versus bring it to here. 
So Gandalf must be sitting on a nice little fortune right now. 900. Good. Anyway, I want to get a few more of these guys in. Small stables. So you and logistics and right there. We're going to be using a lot of them around our farms. So I did put another one in there. You need to be upgraded. We did put something back behind. Oh, right there. So you, hitching post, upgrade, and you, hitching post, upgrade. Okay, good. That's fine. And we could get one family employed doing nothing but. Did we do that there? Well, we're going to do that there. But we just aren't using the planks and timber fast enough, are we? Uh, one in there. Let's go ahead and do it. Let's put one family in here permanently. And we'll see how that goes. Um, what else needs to be done over here before we leave? April is berries. We meet. We're back. We're right at 10. And we're just sitting here not doing anything. Okay, do I leave you? I guess I leave you. We'll see. I wish they somehow would tend to the animals. Like would happen back then. The king's uh, forest. The king's... Uh, deer and you know, manage them as well as hunt them to increase the uh, the numbers um we have the funds to put you in so let's put in our apple orchard we have the funds to put in our goat 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 and goat and chicken chicken <laughs> chicken one, two more chicken, and been waiting a long time to do that. We've got the funds to set up the other two trade routes, specifically trade and you. 160. Oh, that's right. It goes up. Okay, hold off on that one. Let's get our tier twos going and our tier threes going. Let's just make that happen. So what do we need for a tier 3 over here? We need a tavern. For a tavern, we need the malt house. We For a malt house, we need the brewery. You're on. So we you're saying we have booze. Um, this category is what? Malt 0 and ale 33. All right, let's turn you on. Where are you? Right there? Burgage plot. I have a tavern somewhere. You are here. There you are. Farmhouse. No. We have a tavern. So there you are. One family in there. And I don't know how quickly it's going to register that we now have it available. So we'll come back and get that going. We need... Actually, we need three more tier twos. Four more tier twos. So what are you... Where are you? Goats? Sure. Let's... Tier two to you and I'm out of what? Out of logs. Really? Out of logs? Yeah. Timber. Wait a minute. Okay. Too many noises. Can't think. Burgish plots. Burgish plots. Okay. So all oh, that was all the upgrades for the the goats and the chickens probably took all of our logs. I think that's what just happened. But let's trigger you. So not met. You want a fuel supply. Oh. Okay. Give me a, a market stall. Marketplace. Fuel. Right there. So we need more fuel stalls. We do. We could put somebody in there and turn you on. That will guarantee one. I need to find another people now. Um, are we done with our wheat? We are. You two are done. And are we done with our grains? We are. So you guys are still turning you down. You are still making breads, and you're fine. Bread in the system is 271. Okay, so that gives us three families, and I was... So I could also do this to get another firewood stall right there. All right, between all of that, that should turn these back on. But also another thing to check is... Oh, more, more noises. More of the, of the goats going in. I need another marketplace. That is this side over here and right there. Marketplace, fuel. So you guys have got fuel. I'm looking for tier one houses. Leave the mouse right there. Move around. Who's got fuel that is a tier one? You guys do. So you guys can all become tier twos. 
you, and you. And do I have it? One more? I don't. So another family in here here would also help out them. I have six. No, I have six, but they're they're already accounted for. Okay, so that's going. And did I? It doesn't matter. I don't have enough logs to make tier threes. Okay, so I need to get all that to say we need this point before I'm going to start spending any more money on trade routes. Okay, so that is a thing over here. I haven't done almost anything with Gandalf this time, but I think Gandalf can kind of run itself for the most part. Um, we're still filling up all those tier three houses as far as population goes. Over here, we're in great shape. We really could use some more housing. Uh, Food-wise, we are getting lower. Okay, so you are still doing fine. We have one person in that. We have no one in that. Okay, you're over there. We have one family left. Oh, you're over here. Okay. Um, let's leave you for now. We'll clear you out first if we need to. Small stable, and we have two in there small stable we have one more in there we need to buy a trade route though so we're not going to spend it okay so where else have we you put people in you are still not built highest priority and no logs have been transported okay so highest priority but you've been working on what i mean we got you in a long time ago what else is there um, we got you in a long time ago, right? You are in, yeah. And I talked about it. Did I build it? There? Okay, is that a deja vu moment? I needed to get in the you and industry and clay. Why do I have a feeling that I did that? I did. It was back up in here. There you are. So that's being built. And you're working on this, but you have no logs. So logs in the system are 39, but nobody's doing anything with them. Okay. So did I ever set a family in this one? I did. I'm taking you out. You're just too far away. I don't think you're doing anything. Let's put you in over here instead. You are going to be a family running an ox nonstop, moving everything out of the woods where we must have all these trees dropped and you're just gonna have to gonna have to do some catching up all right so firewood stall two firewood stalls just went in so that should satisfy some things over here i wanted more tier threes over here and or tier twos over here but now i'm going to stop now i was thinking it might be nice to have the joiner as a tier joiner over here as a tier three right there can we do it what do we need we can do it requires not met though you need a third type of food or better food supply better more more food stalls okay well hmm the easy answer is one more person in here um the firewood People did put their own in, so I'm going to take you back out. That takes one fuel stall away, but they put their own fuel stall in. So let's put a family back in here, which is going to give us a food stall. Maybe that will be enough to satisfy right there, joiner shop and advance you. Okay, you I would love to advance also, but now we are short on logs. And logs are, just need two more and maybe that'll happen right before my eyes that is the tailor let's do the tailor with the next one then i want to stop the market again the the tavern again so that i can save some save some beer for for later but you guys two families are in here and you're all debranching so as soon as you're done debranching the next tree then it counts as a log i think you just did logs are now three i need one more you just finished Logs are now still three. So two of you just walked away. Two of you are debranching. And I feel like there was two others somewhere else also debranching. You are on your way probably to debranch. And the last one is probably going home. Okay. You guys, three, still three. 
Alright. They just keep swapping sides and swapping sides. Yeah. Okay. Now, something about a watch kettle, right? It just It's not going to happen. Where am I at, by the way? Almost uh, 40 some minutes. You are February. And Treasury right there. We probably have enough for the King's Tax now. And I'm going to say it's going to happen March 1st. The game starts in March. And it didn't happen year five at the beginning, so I guess it happens at the very end of year five. That's probably the best guess now. Um, what else over here? So waiting to set one more tier three, and we're just not happening. Okay, over here, anything else going on that I need to pay attention to? 21 wooden parts are in there. People, one trader's going on. Gimli... Noises, that was a British plot went in level three in Gandalf. Okay, so family moved in to a level three. There we go. Clay furnace just got finished. Oh, the noises. Oh, that was twice of the same one. Okay, um, I do have another family. Clay furnace is right there. Let's get you started. So we'll start building up something to sell. And that was again the same noise. So you were just a very noisy building wow all right so over here any advantage to upping our tier levels could be yeah we could if we're able to do that do i want to add any more houses to any of these other lots are you you're not you guys were um some of these were over here they were let's do that over here you're going in and you're going in. Make sure we still have the ability to bring more families in. And they can just all immediately drop into construction. Okay, so one last chance over here at... At Samwise. Can we get the trailer... Tra Taylor upgraded? We can... You now need... Are we, No, 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 no. We are not out of booze, are we? Where are you... Why do I not see you? Ale, 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 ale. There? No, there. Ale, 31. Okay. So that's just a random thing? It must be. You are a church. You are a tavern. We have an ale there. So is it being stored in here as a food? It is. So it's just a matter of someone going over to get it. And I've only got one family in here anyway, so that is a very slow process. But while there's one available, are you triggered now? You are. Let's get you going. And I'd love to get one more. You, brewery, and four logs. Oh, so close. So we are at two timbers. So wander back over to Gimli. Now, we... I Did I... I did, didn't I? Okay, yeah, you can you can erase that comment. The one that said, dude, you turn on the clay furnace and you don't have any clay yet. All right, so one family over here instead. That's what I meant to do. All right, so you are over there, um, 24 of 40, and one family is in each, and meat is coming in nicely, and that is the only food that we have right now. We are just solely dependent upon wheat, or meat. So, no more selling berries. So, let's just pull that out of there. You are not a thing. We're going to keep that because we can't make enough to get ourselves all the way through the season. That's pretty obvious now. Now, as far as more houses, we did set a few. And we've got one family doing quite a few different housing building projects. Um, this is the biggie right now. And zero logs are over here. I don't know what's going on there. But I am going to say this isn't working. Demolish you, you're done. Can I get rid of any of these roads? Alt, no, no, and no. Okay, I can get rid of you, though. So you go away, and you're just not a thing anymore. All right, so let's put our own windmill in, and let's do it in a more logical place. You and you, and you could be out in this area. You would look good out here. Efficiency 100%, spin you around to the road, Drop you in right there. Perfect. So you're there. Last big noise. Family members join. Samwise is a burgage plot level 2. And Samwise. So let's get the last level 3 
uh, house in here. That will be the uh, the brewery, and you are available, and you're done. Okay, I think I'm almost done too. But let's spend a little time again off and see if there's anything that I wish I had noticed a very long time ago. We are we're pulling a good tax out of here is what we're doing. So let's do that. We're well, we're at ten percent. And we're bringing in families. Do we have anywhere for those families to live? We were working on these guys. That was our, our barometer. So we're still filling tier threes while we're waiting for these guys to come in. We have some families. We could put a road through here and pop you in like so. And just set you until I figure out where you're going to go. Or do we just head to the middle? Do we head to the road? I don't know. Okay, you're right there for now. And let's put in a few more of this style. So H and pop the corner, go across the front there. And how far, I can kick off something like this. That kind of an interesting one. Yeah, and you're over. And we really don't have that many logs. No, you just, you, you were building funny. But I can't get a backyard into there, so that's no good. So you're there and you're there interesting we're not going to do any let's do this not going to do any orchards over here let's do that one that looks good and turn you so it looks like the road's meant to to curve with you like that all right so that road's going to kick off at an angle you guys are next to build and am i down over here we built this one okay two families in so i need to steal a family from somewhere where is that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just did it. I know. You are over here. We are planks 125. We'll steal you for now till we get noticed that we're in trouble there. Did we ever put a family back into here? We did. So there's actually a lot of families in there. So we've got click away. 151 iron. Clay, we could put one family back in there and just get this, this clay done. 83 and we'll be able to delete that soon. Okay, boy, that felt like a marathon. Um, we're good? I think we are. So we got our two families in there. We could put two horses in. That's one more thing to do. So let's grab, we want four horses now. We have officially two livestock traders over here. Families in it. Um, one more peak over there. 12 sheep instead of 11 instead of 10. So we have grown two sheep. And you, I want trade and I want horses. And 25 instead of 30 over here because we have the perk. Export, no, import, and bring me in four. A total of four. And anything else to do with that? We've got the funds. Let's get some serious wool coming in. Um, they're taking a very long time to go from lambs to sheep, unfortunately. So let's import and let's take you up to 10. So 8 are going to be coming in. That's 200. And we can afford it. And anything else we need to do? Yeah, let's do this real quick. So it's by trading routes. We have, they're cut in half right now. So roofing tiles is not a thing for us. So that's not it. But, but these are by you. Small shields are already bought. Um, war bows were a thing. We can buy you. Uh, establish a trade route. So we'll get those three going for now. We were making pull arms. Boy, so many. Yeah, episodes over and I'm still remembering all these things. We were bringing in pull arms for ourselves. We have them. Now we need to be sending pull arms over there. We were, right? You were pull arms for. So over here, we have extra pull arms we do so we're pretty much done with that so instead of taking the time right now to figure that out let's just d family u and d family u and those are turned off and i am too so thanks for watching folks and i will catch you next time Bye bye now